Hello, my name is Peter and I've had the craziest, most extraordinary year um, of my life. We're living in such strange days, what with the pandemic and everything, and it seems that everything that was certain in life has uh, suddenly become uncertain. We all have had to change plans. Many of us uh, know people who have fallen ill and so on. It's been this crazy year. Early this year, I expected to be talking to the church, Lemming's Spahn Baptist Church, to see if the church wanted to call me as their uh, new minister. And uh, that didn't go ahead because lockdown came in. But here I am in my new church office. And, you know, when the prophet Isaiah went through a time of uh, great uncertainty for the people of Israel, he got this prophecy saying the people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Those who dwelled in a land of deep darkness, on them a light has shone. I believe that God, you know, we may be in lockdown from time to time, but God cannot be locked down. God always works, and perhaps God especially works at times of darkness. So that's the kind of thing, the theme that we're going to explore in the run-up to Christmas and uh, Christmas, the God who cannot be locked down. And as part of that, we're going to hear stories of people who've got an experience of um, how God helped them, perhaps through a tough decision or a tough time or a, a problem. We may sometimes not know which way to turn, but God, he is in the redemption business and he can take the situations that we face and do things we, we, we don't even expect and God comes through. He's the God who can't be locked down. And I can't wait to see what God is doing even right now as we speak in this strange, strange year we've had. Hope to see you soon. God bless you.